Hi, today I'm going to review the Kitsch Tree. Um, it's a stand mixer attachment that goes along with your KitchenAid. And it is a fruit and vegetable strainer, ideal for purees and sauces. It actually comes with a fruit and vegetable strainer attachment, a meat grinder attachment, and a sausage stuffer attachment. Today I'm going to make tomato sauce and paste and I'll be using the um, vegetable, fruit and vegetable strainer attachment. First, I'm gonna take this. This goes right in here inside my KitchenAid, and I screw it on here tightly. I screw the, the bolt. Next, I take the fruit and vegetable attachment. It goes in here like this, and then this strainer, it goes inside kind of like, like this. And now I stick the whole thing in here. You can see here, there's these little holes. This is supposed to fit in here. Okay, it comes with this gadget put it right on here like this and you, they say just hand tighten it. So I'm gonna hand tighten it like this. It's a little hard, I kinda feel like I have to push in on it to get it to go. There it goes. Okay, and they just say to hand tighten it. Then this goes and sits goes in here and sits in here like this. It's supposed, this is supposed to be a, to keep it from splashing around and getting all over your counter. Okay. I guess it, it just goes like this. This is my first time assembling it. And then it has, there's a clear part, like a little clear part that goes on top of here. And actually, I don't know where I put it. I can't seem to find it right now. But there is a clear cover that, oh, here it is. This clear cover goes right on top like this. And this snaps into place. And then this, can, can be used, I guess, at the end for taking this on and off if it gets tight. It's like a wrench. But it's also used to push the vegetables and fruit down in there. And so I will, I will leave for now, but I'll come back on when I actually start straining the tomatoes. So yeah, I finished using this Kitsch Tree um, fruit and vegetable strainer attachment to make tomato paste. And after I used it, I quickly rinsed it. And you know, it just rinsed up really quick and it was pretty easy to clean. As you can see, I just rinsed it and used the little brush they gave with it and it just cleaned up really nice. So, so far, um, I'm really happy with this product.